This video probably should have been posted two months ago, but then just before it was, I was like pretty much on. I had like one or two more levels to build, and then someone joined my game and destroyed it all, and then I got to building again. <laughs> so then, month goes by, new stuff added to creative, so of course I have to make it even better than it was before. I was playing Scissors Death Run 3.0. I didn't get to play the first two because I didn't have a console and there's no way I'm playing those Death Runs on mobile. So I played 3.0 and I was like, hey, this looks fun to build. <laughs> not to play, obviously. Death Runs. I'm not good at this game. So when you spawn to this Death Run, you spawn right here. So then here's here's what the entrance looks like. It's Welcome to Death Run, welcoming whoever joined. So yeah, in this death run, you gotta collect coins, so you gotta collect all the coins, so if you miss a coin and a level, then you're not gonna win if you get to the end. And then, I made a level select, just like Scissors did in death run 2.0, except mine's a little different. But I made my level skip go to the center of the map around, in between it all. So then it's all right beside each other, because in 2.0 it was like kind of spread out a little bit. So then it's all right next to each other. There we go, so we got a little message there at the front, and level 1. I'm not going to actually do the death run, because... There'll be too much dying, it'll be so much harder to edit, so yeah. So then after this trap, you gotta go to here and fake out this trap. And then, see this arrow right there? It's pointing up because you can jump through and land on the next thing. So when you jump through, you gotta land in between these two traps so it doesn't kill you. Fake out this trap and then grab the coin, because remember, you gotta grab all the coins to win. You walk on this side so you don't fall through, because see that line there? This is the solid area, and then the yeah. other side, that's, that's, you go right through it. Yeah, so then just more trap dodging. Easy, just like very simple stuff, especially for speedrunners. And then level 2. So then level 2 is just a basic parkour map. And they suck. And I'm terrible. It's pretty straightforward. Is like some of the jumps are really far, and then others are closer than you think. So then, so then some people will overshoot. Like I've overshot some jumps on this death run. So once you once you get to this jump here, you gotta jump onto this one and then jump right away, or just jump onto this platform here because that wall spike will kill you. So. Jump up to here and dodge this trap, fake that trap out, and then jump on to this little thing here, up on to the next one. You gotta fake this trap out, and then go on this side, and then fake that trap out, because you need to grab this coin. And this is like another thing where you go through, see this half is solid, but then this half, you go right through it. And level 3. <laughs> it's an impulse level, you're gonna grab these impulses here. You're gonna impulse up to this. This one, you can't get to that one from here because the ceiling's too low. That's why I made the ceiling lower than it, than it. Yeah, that's why I made the ceiling lower. So then you go onto this ramp and impulse from here onto this ramp on the ceiling. Then you run up and impulse off this ramp in, into this through this doorway and land and land on this platform in here. Then this is the hardest part because you're right up against the ceiling. So then you gotta go just high enough that you can get through that door. So then you impulse off the edge of this thing and then just barely make it through here. And then there you go, that's level three. Level four. So level four is just a simple trap dodging level. Nothing, any death runs I've ever seen before. 
Okay, by the way, level 3, it didn't have a coin because I made it 10 points to win because there was an 11 point to win for some reason. That wasn't a setting. So then I just took I just took off the easiest coin to get, which was level 3. That was the easiest coin to get, so I took that off. So then level 4, I gotta grab this. You can't just run up here and then dodge like that. So like, you can't just run up here and then dodge like that. You actually gotta fake all these traps out and then grab the coin. You keep going, go into this ramp and jump up to the other ramp. You gotta fake out this trap up here and then jump up here and then land on the checkpoint. Alright, level 5, level 5, you get this speed. I don't know what this is called. The move, you go into this movement modulator. <laughs> jump. It, ugh, terrible. It's, sim it's just parkour on larger platforms in level 2. You jump off here and hit the nick just at the very corner. It's a really, really hard jump. It's three blocks. Three, like, I don't know. Blocks, I guess. You gotta hit the very corner of this and then go as far as you can and land. And you will land just on the corner of this thing, which stops your speed. Then you gotta jump through here. See that arrow pointing through here? You gotta fake these traps out you can't just walk through it like this you actually gotta fake these traps out and then get the coin and then after you fake these traps out you gotta jump across this ledge here Ugh. right like that then fake out this trap and then it's just a simple run Ugh. fake out that trap there and then it's just a simple run and jump level six Level 6 you get iced, launch pad, and you, you glide down, and you gotta go fast, okay wait, so this level is very difficult, because you gotta go fast enough that you don't land in this bottom part here, but you gotta go slow enough that you don't fly into this wall right here, and then die from that, so you need to go just barely slower than full speed, and then, and then land on this door and then you can't just go straight down because these traps will kill you so you gotta hit the launch pad from the doorway and as you see that ramp will push you into this spike trap so instead of doing that you land into the ramp and immediately pull your glider and you and, and then you won't get hit by those traps or I think it's possible I didn't try this out but I think it's possible to just go in and hit this yeah I think it is because you're because you're still ice before yeah I think it's possible to jump from this doorway like this and then get boosted before before the traps kill you so then yeah so once you're boosted you'll be you'll, you'll have ice on your feet for this level and you'll go through here and you'll go all the way and then make sure to get close to this wall as possible because there's a, a trap on this side you'll hit this bouncer and then you just gotta fake out this trap and then grab the coin because you need to grab the coin. Next, it, it looks like a dead end, right? But like, if you look closer behind you, there's an arrow there. So you gotta fake out the traps here, make up, you make your own pathway, and then this is another half floor. So this half, this is the line that I'm walking on right here. That. So this half is a solid, and then this other half is just, you go right through it. So if you walk, boom. You land on this checkpoint, and you're at level 7. If you go, if you go straight down, you'll fall through two things and land just in a box full of traps. So you gotta make sure when you jump, you're going through it, you go through it, and then land here, and not fall through here. Alright, level 7, this will be a difficult one, just because you got to do two things at the same time. So, in this level, there are invisible barriers here that will kill you, so you got to you gotta um, make a pathway by dodging traps while also figuring out which way to go. So yeah, so that's very difficult. And to get this coin, you'll be right here, but you can't go forward onto this one because you'll die from the barrier so you gotta go around to the left here and then just grab it and then level eight so in this level you got you gotta get your angles right so you gotta jump onto this first first one 
then hit the second one but you gotta hit, you don't land on top of the second one you hit the side the, the back side so then it launches you forward onto the bounce pad where you land inside this but just try not to get killed by the traps so then you jump up and you don't land on top of this you don't land on the top right there you gotta land on the back side right here yeah the back side right here yeah like that so it'll fling you forward you'll bounce off the top of this one and land here all right so the last one you just jump on top of these two bad boys and you're at level nine okay so over this one you're gonna get ice and then you're gonna you're gonna have to jump on that on that boost on that speed boost because if you don't jump on it you'll just nick the corner and then fall into the into the barrier so you gotta jump on top and then you're good. So it's, a, so it's like an ice parkour level. Go off the bouncer. Oh. When you land here, go through the door and make sure not to get killed by that trap. And then jump to get the coin there and you'll get boosted up. But it'll happen twice. So then you got. Oh. So then I failed there. So once you jump for that coin, you'll get. It'll get boosted off of here, but it won't go quite high enough. So you'll hit the wall and then get boosted again. And the second time, it will be high enough. But you gotta, but you're, there'll be ice on your feet. So you gotta make sure when you go off this bouncer that you're going at an angle like this. So you hit the wall here and don't go into that spike trap of death or hit the or hit that trap. So, last level, level ten. It's gonna be, it's a grappling level. Yeah, so for this one you have to land, you actually have to land on the block, so... Is this in... Consumables. So when you get your grapple, you gotta grapple, but then you gotta land on top of the block because you won't be able to get to the next one. And you gotta go back and run. And yeah, you get, you get the point. Go up and make sure you land. Same thing for this one. It's possible, but like it's very difficult. This one is pretty easy, is so much easier. You jump up and hit it, land on top. This one, same thing. Jump up, get it, and make sure you land on top. This one, go back, run. And I'm terrible, but it's okay. Cause I can fly and you land on top of this and there's one more that one looks like it's super far away but it's actually it's actually just really really tiny so once you and you have to land on this because you got to grab the coin so look it's super tiny compared to the other blocks so once you land on this and you grab the coin boom you're good so all you need to do fall down onto that platform grab the coin at the end and you're done there we go so that's it there's a little message at the end and that's literally the entire death run and I don't know the code for it I don't know how you're gonna know the code I'm figuring out how to get the code okay so apparently I can't publish it if I go to island tools there's supposed to be a published thing here but I can't publish it because I need to prove to Epic that I just don't like build the most random crap that does literally nothing. Like, I need to prove that I can actually build something to Epic, and the way to do the easiest way to do that is like go to a, like a creator like on like on Twitch or YouTube, so and then ask them to try out my death run and post a video on it. And if that happens and it gets popular, then Epic Games will text me or email me or whatever message me somehow and then and then ask if I would like to have the option to publish it <sighs> it's gonna be hard I gotta like subscribe to a bunch of channels this is, this is my plan I'm gonna subscribe to a bunch of channels that do death runs and then just wait wait for and then turn on the bell so I know exactly when their next post is and as soon as they post it I go straight down to the comment section and like put a put a link to the the video for the death run so they can see what it looks like and then 
asks if they can review it and make a video on it and like oh, it's probably not gonna happen it's very very unlikely that it's gonna happen but I'm, I'm gonna try <laughs>